There are more than 12,000 four-year-olds living in Montgomery County, and right now only 440 of them are served by Montgomery County Public Schools in all-day programs and 2,500 in part-day programs. Council members want to expand early childhood education and care services, including universal pre-K, to ensure children who enter kindergarten are ready to learn. Well, the earlier you get a child into structured learning, the better that child performs. And so why wouldn't you want to do that, particularly when you see all the evidence that says this works? We first start talking about the achievement gap. Uh, it starts at a certain place, and that in reality is around access to quality pre-K. Uh, it's something that gives other children an advantage over others as they come into school that might need a little bit more help with reading and some of their basic arithmetic. And so these are the kinds of things that we really want to make sure is open and accessible to all children in Montgomery County. Council members are looking at jurisdictions that have a universal pre-K program and how it was implemented and funded. New York spent $850 million on its pre-K for all program. Council President Roger Berliner acknowledges it will be an expensive proposition, but the return on the investment would be high. Reports out of New York City is if you provide really quality teaching at that age, a quality environment, and invest in a quality environment, the return on that investment is overwhelming. If we can address this early and make a smaller investment while still sizable uh, and make sure that we're stamping out the achievement gap before there even is one, then we've made a solid investment, I feel. Council members say they will look to the executive to submit a proposal for universal pre-K here, ideally when he submits his budget. In Rockville, I'm Susan Kennedy for County Report This Week.